This year, Operation Pangea gathers 115 member countries as well as 236 agencies coming from health, from police, from customs areas. And uh, we are adding up some uh, private sector partners who are supporting the uh, global activities that are delivering, that have been delivering uh, the past uh, week here in Lyon and globally. Operation Pangea 8 reached a kind of a maturity where we can see investigation evolving and illicit online pharmacies being dealt with by member countries differently than before. And we are targeting anchor sites, which are major organized crime that are delivering and developing their activities online illicitly. So uh, there is a different style and enforcement activities, investigation, but also a different look from the agencies and the countries in relation to Operation Pangea 8. At the same time, we see also a better coordination and support uh, from the private sector, which is more and more involved and in supporting Operation Pangea and the countries by shutting down websites, but also trying to stop the payments and even social network-wise with uh, Google supporting and other uh, uh, partners. This year, Operation Pangea 8 saw double valued and double seizures of fake medicines and illicit medicines sold online. Although uh, the agency has been targeting more anchor sites, uh, organized websites online, we see um, a greediness from the organized crime to sell illicit medicines to consumers. So the key message is be aware that the criminals are after you in front of your screens and trying to sell you illicit medicines or products that are not good for your health. So the international communities and countries are here to support and protect your public, uh, your health and your, your houses, but be aware and be responsible that you can be a victim as well.